and welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Vicki. If you are a current subscriber or a fellow friend, welcome back. I am checking in for the second week of March. I am checking in a little early. Today is March 10th, but I know what we're doing here for the weekend. We're going out and we're using a different fund, so I'm not really worried about our weekly numbers. So I'm gonna go ahead and check in. Plus, we've already broke the budget for the week, so I thought I'm gonna cut it off now and just show you what we've spent so far. Okay, so I do have to um, follow up on, on sinking funds, so we'll go ahead and go over those. But let's go ahead and discuss groceries. Now, these are Kara Jo plans. I've talked about them before. I love her stickers. Uh, I'll have a link down below. And okay, so for the week of groceries, it was a crazy week. I spent $200 and $24.70 at Costco. And I went on Monday and just stocked up like crazy. Um, I needed diapers and what else? I, I just got a bunch of stuff and it really didn't feel like a bunch of stuff, but it was expensive. Um, okay, I also, I'm drying my clothes, so it's really loud in here where I'm filming, but I just want to get this out of the way. Also, I needed, I needed some milk on Sunday, so I went really quick and got like berries and milk, and that was $26, so, oh, and some half and half. My mom requested that because she was helping me this week. I also went to Safeway yesterday and I got some keto yogurt that Jim likes and I can't find it anywhere other than Safeway. Um, and then I bought a, a pork butt because I like to keep a pork butt in my freezer. I know it sounds weird saying it out loud, um, but we make carnitas with it or tamales, but I've been making carnitas and with the fat making my own chicharrones and it's been yum. Um, the other thing I did was I got, we do elderberry um, gummies and we ran out. And so this literally is for one bottle of elderberry. I normally get them at Costco, but I didn't feel like going to Costco again. And I had already gone and I forgot that I needed elderberry. So I got it at Target because you could just do a pickup drive through and that's what I did. Okay, uh, we don't have anything eating out this week. And let's see, gas. Gas, <laughs> um, I think I told you that Jim went to Costco and put gas on Sunday, which I was so proud of him. But he went to Union 76 yesterday <laughs> and put gas at a regular gas station. I don't think he filled up because that doesn't appear, $24.99 doesn't appear to be like a full tank of gas. And then I filled up the car on my end it was only twenty nine eleven, but um, I believe that I think it was here on the same day I went to Costco. Um, I just needed a top off because I know we're going to be going to LA here this weekend. All right, um, miscellaneous. Jim also went and played golf after he filled up, rewarding himself. <laughs> for sitting in line at Costco. All right, and then sinking funds. I think I told you I had some sinking funds and we did birthdays. Um, my mom's birthday is coming up. So I took, I already transferred $100 for her, $50 for my niece. Her birthday was really here. And then kids miscellaneous, I got the kids so silly they wanted a huggy wuggy and kissy missy look it up it's horrifying but that's what they they wanted um and then my son's haircut over the weekend all right so those are the sinking funds we'll go ahead and just check in here also, I need to fund last year's IRA, but we did file our taxes, so that's exciting. Do this month, Costco membership, AAA, and trash all got taken out, so we've done that. Oh man, I didn't set up the sinking funds. I haven't done that video. Hmm. I'll do that separately. Um, I'm not gonna. I don't have time to film a video. I'll just go ahead and set it up, but just. If you're new, what it would look like 
is this. And I like to just write down exactly sinking funds tracker. Um, I'm not going to do a video on this section here. Let's do date, amount, fund, and then description. Because then I'll forget who or why I spent the money. And this literally saves me every single time. So we'll do three, four for the amount of 150. And that was at a birthdays. And it was for my mom and Marigena. Um, and then we did kids miscellaneous for $42.94. I am going to round up when I take the money out of our sinking funds. So I'll show you what that looks like. Um, and then this was a huggy, wuggy, <laughs> bug. So silly. And Kissy, Missy, these kids and the things that they're into these days, it's horrifying. Um, 3 7, we also did $15 haircut for Santiago. Okay. All right. And then we're going to go ahead and check in for the second week. And we're gonna use our calculator as well. All right, so we spent how much? 300, oh my goodness, and $7.86. We had 624.27 last week remaining. Take away three, whoops, 307.86. That leaves us with 316.41. We spent $106.50 on gas. We had 596.21 take away 1065. 489.71. 489.71. We had nothing in dining out, so we bring that one down. And then for unexpected was Jim's golf. And that leaves us with 234.59. All right, so let's go ahead and add all these together. We spent for the week 449.36. So we're averaging over four, like 450, I guess. Um, and then remaining, we have $1,215.00. And 64 cents. So if we divide this by the remaining weeks, one, two, three weeks, oh geez, one, two, one, two, one, five point six four divided by three. Oh, it's four oh five per week. Okay, I don't feel as bad. But still, we only have three hundred left, and there's still three more weeks. Right? So we have week three, week four, and week five. Yeah, but we're not eating out, so that might help us with our budget. All right, let's check in with the sinking funds. Okay. We have, what did I say? Kids miscellaneous, um, birthdays. Birthdays is first. Go ahead and zoom out a little bit. All right, I went ahead and 
did the trackers already, so we are taking out 150. Right now we have 543. One, two, three, four, 50, 470, 495, five, five, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 42, 43. We're taking out 150. And it leaves us with 393. One, two, three, 20, 40, 50, 55, 60, 65, 70, 75, 80, 85, 90, 92, 93. 393 in birthdays. Okay, the next one is kids miscellaneous and haircuts. Oh, let's do haircuts here. Went ahead. We had 671 before, taking 15 out. One, two, three, four, five, six, 50, 60, 5, 71, and we're taking 15 out. Leaving us with 656. One, two, three, four, five, six, 50, 56. You might be wondering why we have so much in haircuts. It's because no one got haircuts in COVID and I just keep rolling it over. If we ever need money, we can always pull from here. All right, the last one is Kids Miscellaneous. Kids Miscellaneous. Let's see here. We have, we had 600, we need to pull out 43. So let's count it. So this is a $500 slip, so five, 20, 40, 60, 80, 90, 95, 97, 99, 600. We're pulling out 43. So 43. So 20, 40, 42, 43. And that leaves us with 557. So 500, 20, 40, 50, 5, 57. All right. Well, that is our check-in for the second week of March. Um, I am pulling, we are going to visit my aunt this weekend in Los Angeles. We live in the San Francisco Bay area. Um, and we're using points from our credit card for the stay of the hotel. Um, and then, because we didn't, we actually are tax, taxes aren't going to be as much as what I anticipated. I thought we were going to have to pay capital gains on the sale of the house. So we still owe not much, um, but I have a cushion in my savings account. And so we're going to use that for spending money and gas. So I'll, I'll definitely keep track of what we're spending, but I'm not necessarily budgeting for that. Um, we're just going to take it as it comes and yeah. So let's go ahead and count how much we spent in sinking funds. 150, 170, 190, 200, 5, 7, 8, 208. All right, guys, if you have any questions, let me know. But in the meantime, I'll see you in the next one.